I'm Benny Ng from Hong Kong, a political party founded with a very young bunch of people. And our, Jos our uh, secretary, Joshua Wong, is now in Bell, so he couldn't be here, and I replaced him. In years ago, uh, one of our uh, chairmen, he is run for the he has run for the uh, election of the uh, legislative council. However, the government is keep giving us ridiculous reason, and this, he disqualified uh, one of the uh, lawmaker in the con council. And now the the government have sued us to pay two millions of bill because the the expenses during the Legislative Council. Um, our party, Demo Sisto, is, is found uh, half, one and a half years ago. And basically, we have four manufacturers. Um, Self-determination, autonomous, self-initialization. So, by this kind of uh, manifesto, the, the China government keep bury this kind of thing. They only tell, uh, talk to others, we are an uh, organization, fight for independence, but, but we are not, actually. We are trying to go into the Legislative Council so we can have a voice, we can put our people's voice into the Legislative Council. However, we, after we have been disqualified, or we say dismissed from the seats, we feel frustrated because we only hope our only resources have been gone. For a demo the democratic city, um, people not just can vote, universal suffrage, whatever. The people, if they have no consent of the vote, Although the folks are 90% supporting some statement, it doesn't valid because a lot of people doesn't vote on that. So it's not representing the people in the city. So I think a democratic city, people, the intelligent have to be cooperative and they making common sense, the common uh, idea together. And then finally, yeah, there would be a vote to finally confirm it. For the, what we use technology in a democratic city can be having a different weight. Uh, two years ago, uh, Dr. Benny Tai have initiated, who, who have initiated the umbrella movement, uh, the Occupying Central, he, try to collect all the people decision so he made a portfolio system on the telegram that allow everyone uh, who have some smartphone so he can vote on that using their identity uh, so everyone have its own ticket however this kind of system is not recognized by the government itself and the government trying to say it's uh, illegal Uh, after the umbrella movement, there are many people, uh, 1.2 million people involved in the, in the movement. However, people, we don't get any universal suffrage, but people are start forming a small society, small organization. That how we call people united will never be defeated. So I'm hoping the people uh, have participated in the movement can be also bring back the idea back to the society, back to their community and hoping we gain the next stage in maybe 10 years later.